Hello and welcome to this edition of Fiery Friday. I'm Rob Lienti, Senior Sales Development Manager for EFI's Fiery Business Unit. And today I'm going to show you how you can automate the creation of photo booklets using Fiery Hot Folders and Presets. So in last week's Fiery Friday, I briefly spoke about our new ebook, Automation Building Blocks, and how it reviews the various levels of automation within a Fiery. So today I thought I'd review level one and give you an example of how we can use hot folders and presets to create photo books. So in this example, I have a folder that has eight photographs in it. And our goal is to get these photographs scaled properly and rotated the proper way. So when we lay them out in an 11 by 17 document, it creates a perfect book. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to come here to Command Workstation. And we're going to come over and get into the Device Center. And we're going to go to Job Presets and create a preset for the in position and the stapling. So we're going to name this preset Photo Booklet. And after we name it, we're going to come down and click on Define for Job Properties. And inside of Job Properties, we'll first go to our Layout tab, select Booklet. And we're going to use our Booklet Wizard to create the booklet. So that we're going to make sure it's left bound. We're going to make sure that we are printing on the inside of the front and back cover. We'll select our paper, so we'll select a nice coated chrome coat. It's 11 by 17. Hit OK. We'll go to Next. And then we'll make sure that everything aligns to the center of the book. And we'll hit Next. And now we're finished. The next thing we're going to do is go to our Finishing tab. And we will make sure that we have they have fold selected and center stapling selected for our finishing. So that's the first part of creating the workflow. We created a nice preset. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to open up our Fiery Hot Folders program. And we're going to create the folder that we're going to drop these files into called Photo Booklet. So after we do that, we'll make sure it's going to be on the desktop. We'll select our Fiery. And underneath the Job Actions, we'll select Process and Hold. And underneath Job Properties, we will select our new job preset called Photo Booklet. The last thing we do is we click Edit for Input Formats to make sure that we have JPEG selected. And then we're going to turn on Auto Scale, Scale to Printable Area, which means we want to make sure it's going to be scaled to an 8.5 by 11 sheet. We'll auto rotate any images that need it. Then finally, the output is going to be a PDF, and we're going to merge them into one file and hit OK. So now when we're finished here, you can see that we have our folder. And the last thing we do is we do a right click on the photo booklet folder and send it to the photo booklets hot folder. So what this is doing is this is taking the JPEGs and it is turning them into PDF files, merging them into one file, as you can see here inside a command workstation. You'll notice here that the user is fiery hot folders. And when it's ripped, you'll see the finished result, which took us about three minutes to set up. So we double click on the preview and you'll see that we are photographs are now laid out on 11 by 17 sheets. And if we close out Image Viewer here and go look at the job properties of this job, you will see that underneath Media, our paper is selected properly. And underneath Finishing, we have our fold and our stapling is, is selected as well. So this is a perfect example how you can automate some redundant tasks using presets and hot folders inside your Fiery. I want to thank you for joining me for this edition of Fiery Friday. If you have any questions about the video you saw today, please feel free to reach out to me at rob.lienti at efi.com or message me on LinkedIn. Have a great weekend.